guys. I'm Bob Davidoff from Bentos, the founder and CEO. We're a mining company. And uh, literally backstage, I just threw out my whole presentation to have a little fun with you guys today. So uh, I just want to tell you guys a little story about us miners. And there's something that just haunts me. Haunts me probably for the last year or two. And there's this concept of not being green enough. Literally just every time, you know, not green enough, not green enough, not green enough. Before that, we weren't legal enough, we weren't fast enough, we're not secure enough, we're not regulated enough, but lately, we're just not green enough. So uh, there was this one article out there, maybe about a, a year ago, and it was the most ridiculous thing that I ever saw. It said that Bitcoin single-handedly would increase our temperature one to two degrees Celsius. This literally drove me absolutely nuts. It's like the farthest thing from the truth. First of all, the last time I checked since we're a miner, they don't emit carbon. There's no exhaust or mufflers on a miner. So uh, what they're trying to get at is the energy that we use, that fossil fuel topic that also drives me crazy. Well, uh, what are the things that we like to do as miners, and actually in the Bitcoin community, and yesterday was amazing too because we're some innovators, I gotta tell you. All the applications, everything that's out there is absolutely amazing. And so at Bentos, we're also working on something amazing. I only had five minutes out here, but uh, we just want to make an announcement on what we're working on. So with that concept of not being green enough, and that article, which honestly I wanna find that person one day and thank them because it was the driving factor to actually innovate and create this invention. And this invention is, well, what happens if we turn a negative into a positive and Bitcoin miners do the complete opposite? We take away one to two degrees Celsius. And we could do that through another hot topic out there called carbon capture. So one of the first things that we're working on, we're working on some amazing prototypes out there that the exhaust, the CFM, when you look at a mining operation, and a lot of people would say, okay, well, here's a carbon capture, you guys, you know, I don't have time to go into it, but Google what direct air carbon capture is, and that uses high velocity fans. Well, uh, as a miner, we know that we use a lot of high velocity fans. With that being said, that we're working on some of the first prototypes instead of emitting carbon, we're taking the CFMs from these fans and actually capturing the carbon. So Bitcoin mining now becomes a monetization mechanism or the economies of scale that we all look for in this carbon capture uh, business that everyone's trying to figure out how to monetize. The greats out there, you got the Bill Gates, the Climeworks, even Elon Musk, he has a whole reward out there, $100 million for the best uh, carbon capture because they can't scale it. And I'm here to say that today, well, the reason why no one's looking at Bitcoin is because they got the scouting report wrong. They say that we're not green enough, but honestly, we are the monetization mechanism to plug in and the process to plug in where we can actually drive and actually create the revenue streams to make carbon capture that economies of scales that the greats are looking for. This is some of the stuff that we're working on. This is some of the innovation. You know, you can see that there's a lot of people out there. Us, we're more on the infrastructure side, but some amazing conversations on the Lightning Network, some amazing layer two work that's happening out there. And uh, you know, as my time's running up, because I only had five minutes uh, up here to make this announcement, I just wanted to say that, look out, look what we're doing. We're keeping innovating as a Bitcoin mining community. And that whole green, that's just a lot of FUD. To me, we are one of the greenest things that are out there, and with Bitcoin now, we can have the economies of scale or that monetization mechanism that carbon capture is looking for. But I wanted to thank you guys out here. This was just an announcement that we got to do for Bentos, and we're looking forward to creating all that innovation and, and really becoming green and working with the direct carbon capture guys out there. Thank you very much, guys.